I wanted to pop on quickly as I'm about to send off um, a swap that I've been doing with Laura. We agreed to make each other a few things. Um, so I went a little bit over the top and um, I think we agreed on three or four things and I've ended up making five, six, I think there's six things. Um, but you know, once you get in the swing of it, you just keep going. Um, so I thought I'd share them with you before I pack them up and send them off. So to start with, my first project I made her was this little mini album. It's a hardback one and I've just covered it in some padding material and I've ironed on this little Jack Skellington. Um, and then I would just give you a quick look through. I've not filled it with anything as I thought. I'd just let Laura, she'd be able to do whatever she would like to do with it. There's a little flip out. Just popped a couple of little mats inside. Uh, do, do, do. A couple of little pockets here. And then there's a little pocket up this way. I had so much fun making this, it's so cute. And then you've got a little bit of a flip right there so that is a number one really really happy with it so yeah i was really impressed with myself <laughs> right number two pocket letter so i chose to go with mermaids um yeah i had so much fun um i printed out some images that I found on Google, I think. I think it was Google um, of the mermaids, and then I've just um, embellished them with a little bit of the pearl. Was it this one? Pearl effects, the Dovecraft pearl effects, or I've used glitter just to make them stand out a bit. All the fish. I actually stamped out and coloured. Um, yeah, I just thought it was really cute. And then popped her name on there. And then in the back, apart from this one, um, I've made little envelopes. And then I've just filled the little envelopes with goodies. So, and just pop them in there. So yeah, I really enjoyed doing this as well, it was a lot of fun, so I really hope she likes it. That's the pocket letter. Then I decided that I would make something that wasn't paper craft related. Um, I love to uh, make cross stitch things, so I found this pattern and I made this for Laura. Unfortunately, there's been an accident with the stand, so I am going to hot glue this back on as I've looked everywhere to try and find another stand that this will, uh, just a frame actually, that would fit this in. I haven't been able to find one. So I'm going to hot glue that on. So Laura, I'm, I apologise that that has broken. Um, but yeah, this took me a little while to do, but I just thought it was so cute. That's that one, number three. Number four, oh, was this. Let's take that out a minute. So I made this really cute handbag, even to the point it's got little feet on it. Pop little feet on it, it's so cute. And then you can just a little open. And I have printed off lots of Disney characters, different ones, and then I've just fussy cut them all into little ephemera pieces for her. So we know how much Laura loves Disney. Who doesn't? You know, Disney is great. Yeah. So look at that Jiminy Cricket. I love, I love Jiminy Cricket. Who we got there? Alice in Wonderland. 
Pinocchio and then I had to have a few of these now me and Laura have both got um, children called Mikey um, and I just think that's really cute because I don't know anybody else that's got a child called Mikey um, and then when Laura said that her eldest boy is called Mikey I was just like oh that's cool so and I call my Mike Mike Lesowski <laughs> all the time so I had to put him in and then of course Sally um, so yeah I've just popped them in there I will put these into something else so they don't go everywhere and then I've popped in I had two of these rolls of washi and I think they're really cute so I just popped that in there it's just like um, I don't know if you can see it properly drinks I thought that was really sweet so I've popped that in there as well and I will probably add some more little goodies to this in little bags before I send that off that was number four and then number five so um i showed you um in a haul that i had bought this address book um and this is what i'm going to keep all of my youtube um friends their addresses in to do swaps and things like that um but i did mention that i did originally want to make one for myself well i decided that i would make one for laura <laughs> So it's not, you know, there probably is better ones out there, but I've, I've done the binding and everything myself. Um, I'll just give you a quick look. So I sectioned it all. Um, I found these alpha stickers that match the same uh, foil in here. So I popped them in and then I've just divided it up for a... Uh, um, all the way through so yeah that was a lot of fun to just pop together so that's number five and then number six okay so I made a traveler's notebook um, I have tried making different types of traveler's notebooks before and I had the idea there and I kind of know how to do it but it never works out right and then I decided to try again excuse me keep yawning and this is I'm just going to move these bits out of the way um, so that I can actually show you properly let's move these over here so I made this so I used some faux leather that I had um, and I used some paper um, yeah so I adhered them together with some heat and bond and then I went around and I added a little pocket there and I went around with some embroidery like cross stitch floss and put in some stitching and I'm just I just think it's cute <laughs> I'm really impressed that I managed to do it and it actually turned out all right um, a note for next time I had to put different stitches going up to hold the pocket in um, ideally I should have stitch that onto the paper before I then adhered them together but you know you have to make these mistakes to learn from them but I'm sure Laura won't mind I then made her an insert um, a nice big thick chunky one so pop that in so I really really hope that Laura likes these um, like I say I've impressed myself with some of these. <laughs> I've been, um, I've been, just been so happy that I've managed to get some of the things <laughs> right. You know, they're not perfect. They're not perfect, and I'm sure there's better ones out there. But I've had so much fun making them and putting them together. Um, I really enjoy doing swaps with people. Um, so yeah I really really hope that Laura likes all of these bits that I've made for her um, and if anybody else wants to do a swap at any time feel free to get hold of me 
um, like I say there's just something just that little bit special when you're doing a swap with someone so it's it's all cool so thanks for watching guys and I hope you really like everything Laura see you later bye